After being on vacation for a couple of weeks, had to go through my mail when I got back. One of the things I found, not a sports magazine, the Old Farmer's Almanac, a little book that tells us a lot about the future. One of those, the weather for January 15th in the Spokane Chiefs outdoor hockey game. And it says, very cold and snow. That should put a smile on Bobby Brett's face. But what this little book doesn't tell us is how this Cougar football season is going to turn out. There weren't very many smiles after Saturday's game at Oklahoma State, and I'm not talking about the Cougar players or coaches. Cougar fans are not happy with the first game because it looked a lot like the past two seasons. We shouldn't jump to conclusions after one game, but the ride that the Cougar fans have been on has not been a bowl of cherries the last couple of seasons. This weekend's game won't tell us anything. The Cougars will host Montana State. My guess after the loss to Oklahoma State, this will be the only game that the Cougars will be favored to win the rest of the season. As I thumb through the Farmer's Almanac, I sure wish it would tell me how the Cougar season is going to turn out. It sure would make things a whole lot easier. You can chime in, as always. Send your emails to areyoukiddingme at 700ESPN.com. That's areyoukiddingme at 700ESPN.com. I'm looking for the Seahawks, too, while since we're in here. <laughs> That, you know what, this was printed a couple of weeks ago. <laughs> With all the changes they've made, this would be completely obsolete yeah. even if it had yeah. it two weeks ago. I know, Good I'm point. not going to recognize anybody on that roster this year. If you're a <laughs> may or may not be a fan, good thing. you want the, yes, biggest, probably a good thing. the biggest winner is going to be the guy who sells the programs. He's going to make a boatload of cash in yeah. Seattle.